it's your boy Young Juan. I know, I know. It's been a minute since I dropped a video talking about anything, but uh, I've been deployed, got back to work. We got this pandemic going on, so it's just, it's just been a lot. So, but I am happy to say that I'm finally dropping a video, 2020. And uh, today's video, I got a little something special. I got that iPhone 12 Pro, not the Max, cause I was impatient and I didn't wanna wait for it. But anyway, not the Max, I got the 12 Pro. I'm gonna unbox that thing for you. Um, and yeah, let's get into it. Boom, we hit you with it. Here it is, that bad boy. iPhone 12 Pro Gold. You see it right there, you see it all in the description. Um, that box is, you see it. Very thin. This year they don't come with a charging brick. They don't come with no headphones. They just come with a cord. So <laughs> you get a cord with this phone. So it's, it's lightning to USB type C. So pretty much you gotta purchase your own charging brick for it. So yeah, that's kind of bogus. I mean, I wish they would have shipped uh, a USB type C adapter with it or with the even with the older phones. That way we don't have to go out and pay $20 for a power brick. But you can use the, the old charger that you have. It won't have fast charging on it, but you'll still be able to use it. Um, wireless charging still works on it. Um, MagSafe works on it as well, which is the magnet is built into the iPhone and then it attaches to the charger. So every time that you put it on, it's like, boom, it's already charging like it just automatically connects to it so i think i'm gonna i might purchase that i don't know that's 30 dollars um yeah. it just depends on how i feel but you can definitely charge it with your old charger now if you're new to iphone and you don't have a charger brick that is unfortunate because then you will have to go out and buy a charger brick or borrow one of your friends or yeah just get the mass safe charger or wireless charger it does work with Qi wireless charging, um, any Qi charger, you can just set it down on top of it and it will continue to charge so you won't have to worry about that. Yeah, it's I like the sleekness though. It's kind of that's kind of dope. I ain't even gonna lie. That's pretty it's pretty fresh. But uh let's pop this thing open, baby. That's the front of it. You got the new box. Pretty cool. I already took the paper off, so I don't even worry about all that. <laughs> but uh yeah, let's open this thing up. Boom. Sheesh. Look at that, boy. That is fire. Oh, uh, new, new little cover on it. That gold is clean. Oh, I can't even stunt. That gold. <laughs> oh, wee. Yeah. It's going to be a pretty print magnet, but on the size, but that thing is perfect size. Same size as the iPhone uh, 11. Um, yeah, got that three camera, got the LiDAR sensor in it. Let's see what else coming in this box. Like I was saying, US uh, Lightning to USB Type C. That cable in there. What else it come with? Got your SIM ejector. Got your instructions. And then you got your one sticker now. So it's like very minimalistic in this box. But yeah, man, I like it. I like it a lot. Like this thing is very sleek. It reminds me of the iPhone 4, iPhone 5 uh, design. Um, I've always liked that design. It's pretty dope. Um, that gold, man, that gold is just fire. <laughs> oh, wee, man, that's, that's, that's beautiful. It's a little heavier. Um, that's because it has the stainless steel on the sides man wow i am impressed go ahead and pop the top on this bad boy Whew. clean now it did say it had the the crystallized ceramic front on it to where it won't crack when you drop it but at the same time, it is scratch prone. So if you 
do decide to rock it no case, I would say at least get a screen protector. But yeah, overall, I mean, it's a nice, it's a nice size, nice color, man. This color is fire. I can't wait to see the Pacific blue. I got a homeboy that just got one, so I'm gonna see how that looks. But yeah, it is definitely a dope design. I love that boxy design. It's just, it's like a sense of nostalgia. Like it is, it is, it definitely reminds me of the iPhone uh, 4 that came out. Um, let's talk about a couple of specs. We got the 128 gigs. That's what it starts off as. And then it goes 256 and then 512, 6.1 inch display. So that is the exact same as the iPhone 11 and the iPhone 12. So same size, it was a little bigger than the um, iPhone 11 Pro. That was a smaller one, that was I believe 5.8. So it did get a little bigger. It has that A14 Bionic chip in it. So what that mean is uh, it's just a little faster than it was last year. So the camera, you have ultra wide, wide, Telephoto lens, still got the lightning cable. Did not switch to USB type C on the bottom, which I, they probably will never do. They gonna keep with the lightning and let you USB type C to lightning to USB type C, so. But first impressions on this phone is pretty dope. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like the iPhone, the iPhone um, 10s Max had that round top to it. I know a lot of people have that and they are looking at upgrades. So, you know, this video is pretty much for the people that got iPhone 10s Max and lower. Um, because if you got 11 or 11 Pro, it's, it's iffy if you want to upgrade. I know I want to upgrade from 11 simply because I don't really care for the LCD screen because I, I notice a difference. Like other people, they might not notice a difference, but I definitely notice a difference. I'm a, I'm a little, little nerd. Honestly, if you upgrading from the 8, the 10, the 10s Max, the 11, and honestly, I would say the, the 11 Pro as well because it's a lot, it's smaller than the 12 Pro. I will upgrade. But if you have the 11 Pro Max, I don't think you should upgrade. Like, I honestly just think you should just wait and because your phone has a bigger screen, has OLED screen. Um, it's just so many specs on there that it's a slim margin between the 11 Pro Max and the iPhone 12. But if you really want the biggest jump, I would say wait for that iPhone uh, Pro Max, 12 Pro Max to come out. That is where you're gonna get the bang for your buck if you wait for that 11 Pro Max. So anyway, appreciate y'all for watching. Um, subscribe to the channel, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I love doing this, it's uh, pretty fun, so let me know what you think, man. Let me know what you gonna get. The iPhone 12 Pro or the iPhone 12 Pro Max or even the iPhone 12 mini, which is way too small for me, so I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna mess with it. But anyway, have a great day, everybody. <laughs>